that direction. graduation well my graduation vlog today is not my graduation today is the beginning of the prep anyway i took off my braids so i'm going to go get a new braid and of course i did not make an appointment so i don't know oh welcome back to my channel if you are a new subscriber i have so many new subscribers hi welcome i'm like yay <laughs> and if you're done your subscriber Ah, thank you for coming back. That a craziness. I'm not scared you away. But yeah, so I'm going to get my hair done. And nah, I'm not doing anything different. I'm doing exactly what I did. The same cornrow. That cornrow, it, it suits my face. Like, I used to just do all back cornrows. But this one, like, you know, the style I did last, amazing. So I'm doing it again because I'm still wearing wig, basically. But yeah, oh, my my passport came. My passport came. It came so quick. It's like one week and Thursday, Friday, Saturday, one week and three days. This is the old one, and this is the new one. It's so new, and these people have gone to like stamp, cancel, cancel. So I can't even use it. Although this one expires in 2024 February. The new one, I was hoping the new one will start 2024 February. But no, it started on the day I applied. Which is sad. But new passport. Don't see my face. I have a new passport. You can't use the old one. It's cancelled. But yeah, I just wanted to update you guys on that. It just came in today basically. Like literally this morning. But yeah, I'm going to make my hair, do my nails. And if I still have time, oh, I want to finally carve my brows. I've not done my brows like professionally. I just use my hand to like do, 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 shape it. Well, I'm going to pay for someone to do it. <laughs> and I don't put makeup on my face because I want to go buy makeup things. So I want to swatch, 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 swatch everywhere. But yeah, oh, is it even necessary? But the perfume I used is from. Kiali, why are you? It's like this Kiali perfume, Love Fest Burning Cherry. It's a good perfume. It's, it's strong, but it's good, strong. People like it on my body more than I like it on my body, but I still love it because it smells so good, but like strong. I like like soft vanilla. But it's an amazing perfume. Like when I wear it, everybody's like, What are you wearing? What are you wearing? And I'm like, it's just is that <laughs> anyway yeah let's go i think that's what i'm doing i don't know let's go i found like a two hour parking space hopefully it takes less than two hours because i had to find free parking <laughs> i don't know oh i drove of course that's why i parked because that was that was like the fastest way i'm kind of late for someone that wants to just drop in my glasses is doing that thing I was trying to show you guys turning like shades into shades when the sun is out. See you guys. Bye. So 
I'm done with my hair. This is what did. I just did exactly the same thing. I'm not even going to die. I just when I came, I was like, Do you remember my face? She said, Yes. I was like, Do exactly the same thing you did before. Same thing. Oh, I didn't mention before. This is just my hair. I have weird hair. Sometimes it doesn't feel long, but then when I braid it down, it feels really long. But yeah, it's already at 12 18. This is a two hour pack, which I'm pretty sure I must have passed by a couple of minutes. But I'm going to now do my nails now, okay? Also, I did this red nails and I just, I love it. So, but I'm trying to fix my nail because I have my graduation, okay? So, but I want to keep the red nails, but I want to do acrylic. So, I want to do this one, keep the same red team. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> And then I'm going to, so all the makeup things I've, I own in my life, I bought two years ago. The last time I stopped filming, it's almost two years now. That was the last time I, I bought makeup stuff. I've not been doing makeup like, like that. So now I need to buy new makeup stuff. And I've made a list. I don't know who, I don't know if it's just me, but I like things being very organized because it helps my head, okay? It helps my head. So I have like a makeup list of things that i need to buy just normal list and then i have like makeup like detailed lists like primer i have options foundation concealer setting setting powder different things i have options okay and to make it even much more specific i like how i do things man <laughs> it's funny but it that's way it works to make it even more specific I took like screenshots of the product so that when I go to this mall, also I, I put like foundation, the name of the foundation, the store where they sell it in Australia. So it just makes shopping easy. I don't have to spend a lot of time there walking around. Plus research, what's the best foundation for oily skin? The best foundation for combination skin? The best primer for like, and then the three best, okay? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. So after I do my nails, hopefully if there's still time, I'm going to go and buy makeup things. At least I'll buy some of them today. You know, yeah, I'm st let me stop talking. I'll see you guys in the nail shop.
I'm back. I don't say anything yesterday when I did my nails. Oh, my nails, they're so pretty. Can you just focus on these pretty nails? Focus, yes. Yes, please. So nice. I wanted to keep the red thing going. So this is so pretty. I changed my nose ring. <laughs> the first one I did was like, B. So this is the first nose ring I, I wore when I pierced my nose, right? Like the round one And then I changed it to the stud one But I've been wearing that stud one for like a year I was like, I want to switch it up back to the round one Because I like the round one And then I put that first one in the first store where I bought it And then it was so expensive Like what? Not expensive, what am I saying? It was so big Well, and pricey It was so big and she was like, this is the smallest one here Ah <sighs> And then I had to go find another place and then I saw this tiny one. It has like details of like, I don't say diamond, but I'm pretty sure it's not real diamond, but it has details of diamond there. <laughs> and so it's small, it's like, it's still professional, but it's still cute. Anyway, unboxing, we'll start with Mecca. Hey God, the amount of money I spent today. Hey, she naked me. But I'm just, I'm just saying this is, this is an investment <laughs> this is an investment i mean not an investment per se but the product i have here is over two years old i don't want to burn my skin but anyway we're getting ready for graduation so yes i showed you guys how i do this um how i arrange the things i have to buy in my notes literally the best thing to do so i have like primer different primer different foundation different concealer like the best that I've researched and I've put down the price and everything beside it so it's easy for me to shop that way I don't have to buy everything there just like one one of each anyway so from Mecca I got this um Charlotte Tilbury there are setting spray that everybody talks about it's an amazing setting spray this is how it looks like so cute apparently because I have oily skin like really annoying oily skin anyway the second thing which is the foundation i had to go and buy is the st lauder foundation also the reason why i went to go and buy these things in store is because i needed to be color matched i've never been color matched before this is what it looks like if you don't know since i came to australia i feel like not since i came to australia australia doesn't really i don't know if you go to like the local stores to buy makeup you don't see our shade it's really sad but it's very 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 hard to find like dark skin shades in the store so i usually order things online i got nas nas concealer i got two shades i don't know why i just felt like the first one is too dark and then i felt like the other one is too bright i don't know and things were like again it's so hard finding our shades right so i always order things online i got two shades of nas yeah, I feel like this one might be too bright, but it's good because it brightens you on the eye. And then, oh, I also got another Charlotte Tilbury airbrush press powder. The girls have been screaming about this powder. Is it powder or powder? I think it's powder. And what other words? But the, oh, cute packaging. But the girls have been screaming about this powder and I was like, I need to get it. I need to get it. So I got it. Period. This is what it looks like. Finally, something that is probably in my shade. I don't know. And then the last thing from Mecca is the Laura Mercier setting powder. This is like the new one that the Ultra Blow, not the original one that came out. This is what it looks like. This one is in translucent honey. Just to set my eyes. And then here, I went to Sephora, you guys saw. But I only bought one thing in Sephora and I was like, I'm not spending this amount of money anymore. I'm going to drugstore. So I needed my base to be something that is good quality. So like my foundation, my concealer, setting spray, setting powder, and primer is like, okay, I'm willing to spend to get this because they're the base. But things like eyebrow, eyeliner, nah. I'm going to the cheap ones. By the way, the cheap ones are fine, like Maybelline and NYX. Anyway, I got the Fenty Beauty... It's the, the, like a soft matte um, primer for matte. Hi, so much packaging. But this is it. 
So this is the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Instant Retouch Primer. So this one is a soft matte. Everything I got is matte, but I didn't want to get things that are too matte matte because I don't want to dry my face. So this one is like a soft matte. It's not the matte matte one. It's like good enough, but not too good. Then the rest of the things here are from Priceline. I think I was saying how it's so hard to find like a foundation shade in your in your shade like a foundation like our skin tone is hard it's hard so i end up buying foundations online or like skin products online and then at the end of the day it's not my shade and i just dump them and then i don't use them so i was like today i'm going into the store and she color matched me she did everything anyway i got this nyx brown eyeliner I don't know i like doing eyeliner but like i don't like it being too dark so i was like oh brown is going to be like a good option for me so this is like a brown eyeliner i'm kind of like looking forward to using it i got two i got two blush um blush what <laughs> adhesive adhesive okay but they are both from oh i thought they were both from keys this one is from Wow, well, they're not even from Kiss. But I got this one. Uh, it's too bright. And then I just lash glue. I don't know. Then I got these Kiss lashes. Because people really talk about Kiss lashes a lot. Can you focus so that my people can see you? Thank you. Thank you. I don't know. I got... I... <laughs> What's this? Oh, eyeliner eyeliner from Maybelline and then I got oh I got a second primer but this is from elf and this is also freaking good so I was like I'll just get one pricey primer and one affordable primer this one so many good testimony and then I got this this is like a skin tint I only got one foundation from that crazy store but I wanted like an another affordable foundation that is like a skin skin tint skin tint this is from Maybelline's like super stay skin tint foundation they don't really have a lot of shades again they don't really care about that dark skin but Maybelline has other shades though but like I think in this in the store just just in the store see I don't know about the actual company website but in the stores in Australia it's none of their business this literally not their business but i got two shades this one that is like a bit dark and this one that is like a bit light together they'll be my perfect shade that's 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 the only thing i can do i think the only thing that'll be my perfect shade there is the other foundation anyway i got this elf blush because it's so pretty and then lastly i got this nyx lip gloss because i love nyx lip gloss and then oh i got a brow pencil up and seal for course anyway this is not very long but yeah so basically i mean that's how i shop everything is like the things i got in each section i'll just tick it i don't know i just feel like it makes things very organized but anyway i'm exhausted i want to go make food because i want to go make food but i really i really want to vlog like where i'm cooking and all that stuff but I want to get my own apartment because I can't do that here because it's weird taking my camera with me up there. But yeah, I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, welcome back. I'm at the airport. What I didn't tell you guys <laughs> since I started vlogging again is that my sister came to Australia. Well, she's been in Australia since January. Yeah, since January. And I've not seen her. If anybody screams, everybody in real life has been screaming. Can I see your sister? How can I stop you in Australia? I never seen her. She's in Queensland, but she's going for my graduation. So I'm at, here at the airport to pick her up. So let's go and pick her up. Ah! <laughs> she's my last sister. The last baby. Oh my god, I'm so like <laughs> Yeah, let's go. She has already arrived, definitely. Because I have this flight tracker that I used to track flights. So she's already here. She'll probably be getting her bag. So let's go pick her up. Look at her. Wait, oh, so Jesus is calling. Wait, let me accept. Stand there. Accept. Stand there. Let me accept. Okay. So so you don't know that you test me that I'm leaving. I know. You didn't tell me you're leaving. I was just tracking your flights. Uh, 
is it you are tracking as I don't know how to People of YouTube, <laughs> look at this, my sister. <laughs> this, how will how we not tell me that I leave? I don't even know if you've bothered, if you missed your you flight, here? nothing. I just like, let me just just track this flight and come here. Wow. Well, thank you. Do you look alike? <laughs> hey guys, so we are here. Oh, I gave her my hair. The things you do when you ask small sister. And I'm here to collect more. It's just that long one that you said I should give you in that video. Okay. The recent video you posted. No, that video when I went to that place, that restaurant, I did like video with long video. Say, so give me the end. Okay. So it's already like, I feel like, since I've worn it, it's more. Mm. I even like washed it and straightened this so you can wear it tomorrow. Thank you. Ah, thank you, Jesus. I now have wig. Thank you, sis. See you. <laughs> I've not seen her in like three, year, three years. Two years in Nigeria, one year since she came to Australia. Almost one year since she came oh, to Australia. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, we'll see you guys tomorrow in my graduation. <laughs> I'm happy. I don't know how to show excitement. Honestly, like, I mean, we're it, it, it's it, weird actually, generally. You don't have to show excitement, but you're excited. Yeah. I mean, it's a family thing. It's a family thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, bye guys. <laughs> hey guys, it's my graduation. I'm getting ready. I've done my hair, did my whole thing. Now I'm about to do my makeup. Okay, but I want to vlog you for shots like TikTok, landscape, portrait. Like portrait. Yeah, portrait. Anyway, yeah. <laughs> And I'm going to get ready. Next time you guys see me, I'll be like, oh, after this graduation vlog, I'm going to post the two vlogs that I filmed a year ago. One is my first day in school, in like going to school in class, and then the other one is like a week in my life. Because I was just thinking back, and I was like, oh my god. I can remember my first day when I went to school. <laughs> like being in school, like, and then look at me going back for graduation. Anyway, almost late, so let me go and get ready. I want to do a cute transition. Okay, guys, so we are on the way to the transition
Nam of Dili. Earlier, but we took the heart. So cute. Today has been so long and so stressful, and a lot of like self reflection. Like, oh my god, I came to Australia, and then media communication, and then I came to social work, and then I had to do grad deep in human services, and then social work, and those stressful years of assessments and all that stuff. Psst, insane. Well, yeah, so I stained my clothes. They gave us food, not food, like they gave us something you can eat after the program. And in my amazing self, I always stain everything. I see, I'm 
my mother, I feel like my mother has like holes sometimes when I'm eating. But yeah, it's been amazing. You guys have been here with me since I came to Australia basically. And now, so hey, it's about graduation. <laughs> Alright, I want to end this vlog here. Because this is supposed to be my graduation vlog. Yeah, and I'm exhausted. But um, the next video is going to be my first day in school that I filmed a year plus almost a year and six months ago not like my first day in school i was trying to explain before it was more like um i've you know we've been doing like zoom meet zoom classes it was like the first time i took a class physical class and i was like oh that's nice so i see you guys with me and then that period is like when i stopped i just everything got so crazy and i was so overwhelmed so i just stopped filming and then i took that unexpected one year break so i'm going to post that video and after that day i also filmed like a week in my life like realistic week in my life a year and six months ago and yeah so that's the next two vlogs so i really really deserve to take a break i'm exhausted but i'll still film maybe i'll do a new like an updated realistic week in my life yeah I think I'll do that but yes thank you guys for always watching my videos and everything and stay with me through my social work master's degree program and my hair came out so cute and I messed up my baby hair but who cares I graduated baby hair or not anyway thank you guys for watching <sighs> let me go back and keep doing my self reflection <laughs> I mean that's technically what social work is, self-reflection. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and comment. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Oh, thank you guys for all the congratula congratulatory, congratulatory messages on Instagram. Thank you.